Alma of the Airwaves, Lucky of the Orange Couch, on November 1st, 2022. It is a Tuesday. Lucky is behind the portrait of my mom. My mom passed away 14 years ago today on All Saints Day. It's All Saints Day. She died in her sleep, as they say, only saints uh, pass on. Uh, she went to bed on Halloween, uh, 31st of October, and she didn't wake up on Saturday, November 1st. Okay, so here is another attempt at her. Okay, it's not ready, but I'm revisiting this portrait. So I started it a long time ago, but today I tried to kind of, I'm getting somewhere. Okay, the church I usually go to, which is very close, which is called All Saints Church, it's a Serbian church, very close by. It's, it's actually closed on Tuesday. I called the pastor because I know him and he said, nope, we're not open. It's one unusually warm day for November, plenty of sunshine. So now uh, I will go and uh, visit another church to lit the candle. I cooked as always uh, barley for my mom, barley, which is with raisins, walnuts, uh, cinnamon, orange peel, lemon peel, um, sugar, icing sugar. What else? It's beautiful. So this is barley. It goes to my neighbors. Later on, I bought her a carrot cake because she used to like carrot cake quite a bit and also smoked salmon. That's on our menu for her memorial. So you'll see all this in the video. You also will see the end of uh, Halloween last night a little um, just when we walked, um, when we actually drove past um, some decorated uh, houses for Halloween uh, with Lucky. And the other thing I'm gonna include is another video actually from the, from the beach you're going to see the food, but I have to make my recommendation for the day of a book and of a person. Anna Lemke, or Lemke in English. She's a psychiatrist and works in Stanford in addiction, in the clinic for addiction. She wrote mm, a few books, but her latest book, Dopamine Nation is amazing. So without any doubt, she has done, and she says that uh, in all the interviews, she has done my 12-step program. She's in recovery uh, from addiction, but her insights and everything that follows from uh, her research is just amazing. In almost one sentence, she proves that the center, the part in our brain, which is responsible for both pleasure and pain are co-located. So they're at the, same, at the same part of the brain. The lizard brain, the oldest part of our brain, which has been with us for millennia. We as humans evolved and, discovered and, and developed other parts of the brain, but this oldest part of our brain, the lizard brain, is responsible for pleasure and pain. So she says that all we need is a balance, homeostasis, right? The balance between pain and pleasure, because we usually go either way. Every time we experience pleasure, it's followed by withdrawals and we go into pain. Her um, breakthrough is extremely simple. She says that this part of our brain is not prepared for the abundance of uh, stim stimuli that we experience these days. So we are bombarded by so many uh, ways of experience, 
experiencing pleasure, that this is stressing us out to the extreme. Addiction, it's an amazing book. So uh, please, I'll put the title on at the end, Google her, Anna Lemke, all over the internet. That's my recommendation. Since my mom was a doctor as well, pediatrician, so we're going to pay tribute to all the people who have dedicated their life, their lives to help others. See you tomorrow. Tomorrow is Wednesday. For my mom today, <clears throat> I made barley with walnuts, raisins, um, sugar, breadcrumbs, cinnamon, orange peel, lemon peel this is a carrot cake she really liked it and she really liked smoked salmon so that's for her today <laughs>